Hi, could I get a tall ice white mocha? And then could I do blonde shots and then add a shot and no whipped cream? Jazz, you no problem. What is it? And then do y'all have the bacon gouda and egg sandwich? Yep, do that for you. Okay, and then that would be all. Okay, perfect. That's gonna be six minutes. Get them awesome, thank you. Or right, I'm sorry, I'll lie. It's, <laughs> gonna be, it's gonna be 1137. That sounds right, thank you. Hello, get a straw with that. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, you guys, and welcome to today's video. So I got up, showered, ate a banana, and then I got myself a Starbucks coffee, and then I got the husband a sandwich before he goes to work. And then I do have class in a couple of hours, so I did not want to have to pump gas on the way to class, so I am just stopping to get gas now. So today's vlog is all about me going to my first day of class, my first day of grad school. I'm extremely nervous because you like don't know what to expect. I'm going to a new school. I'm in a new state going to school. It's grad school. It's not undergrad. So everything is focused on you know the degree you're in and it's kind of like heightened when it comes to how they grade and stuff like that so I am a bit nervous but I'm kind of going to take y'all along the journey with today can we also talk about how much more expensive gas keeps getting like every single day I feel like it's time goes it just gets more and more expensive but okay let's head home and then I have to get a video up on my channel my other channel so we're gonna go home and do that okay so now that I'm home I am going to get this video up respond to comments and then I'm gonna get ready because I washed my hair last night so my hair's all crazy don't have my like go-to makeup on or anything like that because I kind of wanted to do all of this so after we get this video up respond to comments I'll get ready for the day Okay, I now have transferred to the spare bathroom and I am going to get ready. I actually love my iPad, <laughs> using it to watch TV while I'm getting ready. I used to use my cell phone to like watch TV while I'm getting ready and stuff like that, like Netflix or whatever. So I'm glad that I have my phone and then that's on like in the background. So I'm gonna get ready and then watch Suits. So pretty much all I do to like do my everyday makeup is sunscreen. So I use the Super Goop Unseen sunscreen. It's been working really well for me in the sense like it doesn't break me out or anything like that because I am prone to breaking out. And then I like to fill in my eyebrows, but I fill them in lightly because I already have like pretty full eyebrows. I use these three things. So pretty much a random, oh, it's not random. Never mind. It's a Morphe MB29 brush. So it has the little spoolie on it. I think I've had this literally for like eight plus years. It's the one I have, it's the one I use, and then I use the NYX Control Freak Brow Gel, which keeps your brows in place. And then my tried and true, I've been using this, I feel like ever since I was a teenager, but the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Definer. I do my eyebrows and then I pretty much just do mascara and that's it <laughs> for my like everyday makeup. So I know that I normally do this for work. So I'm pretty much gonna just be using this routine for school. I don't find the need to like put on a bunch of makeup for class or anything like that. And then I'm gonna straighten this hair because it's just all over the place. So yeah, let's get ready. So I'm currently on what episode of Suits? Season seven, episode nine. <laughs> and it's just, it's just too good. Anyways, got ready for the day. I'm trying to think what else I have to do. I think I already packed, yeah, I already packed my school bag. 
So that's all ready. Like I put all my stuff in it I need for that specific class. I'm ready for the day. I did the dishwasher. I swept and vacuumed the house. So yeah, I guess I'm gonna go figure out what YouTube stuff that I have to get done today for the rest of the week so I can focus on next week's videos. Let's do that. Okay, y'all. So this is my fit for class. I swear this is like the most chill outfit ever, but who else wants to go to like an evening class? Not being relaxed, so I just have my American Eagle tee, Nike joggers, and then my Nike sneakers. <sighs> and then I've got my backpack all packed and ready to go. So I've got my water here. It fits perfectly. I know a lot of people complain that this backpack, like water bottles don't fit easily, but my Lululemon one does. But yeah, got everything I need. So yes, I'm extremely nervous. A lot of people ask me like, oh, are you excited? And I'm like, yeah, I'm excited, but I'm way more nervous than I am excited because I just don't know what to expect. So I guess I will see you guys after class. Okay y'all, so I got out of class early because it's the first day. So we kind of went over like the basic things you need to go over for the class and introduced ourselves and stuff like that. I really think I'm gonna love this one and I think I'm gonna hate my other two classes. Like I feel like this one's gonna be one that I really enjoy and love the professor. And then the other two are gonna be like horror for me. But I now have to go return a package. So I actually have two packages to return, but one is to UPS, one is to the post office, and it's already too late to go to the post office. Um, so I'm just gonna run, like I literally drove from class to the UPS store, so I'm gonna run in here and send off this patch patchet, this package really quickly, and then I'll just have to go to the post office tomorrow. It was also nice to get out of class early because I literally wouldn't be out of class for like a decently long time. Like we got out over like an hour and a half early today. I know it's not gonna be like that every time, but I'm gonna take advantage of the day that it is. Okay, I just sent the package off. That was literally 30 seconds of my life. That was the easiest thing ever. And me and the girl were laughing because I was like, I cannot, like, I don't know the difference between USPS and like UPS, like the post office. I don't know the difference between them. I don't know. I didn't know that USPS was like the post office. I had no clue. Um, so I do have this one package to send, but it says USPS. I believe that that is the post office. I also didn't notice that my camera, like when I have my glasses on, it doesn't detect my face. So it can be like a bit dark. So I apologize if some of the lighting was like that, but now we're gonna head home. It was actually quite the journey to like drive because it was rush hour, but now I'm back on my side of town. So I'm just gonna head home, take Kai for a walk in the 100 degree weather. And I'll probably relax tonight. I'm debating this already start like some of my stuff, like reading my textbooks. I believe next week for one class, I need to have two chapters read. For this class, I have a paper due the day after next week's class. So it'll essentially be like, I want to like do things ahead of time. So I'm debating to like get that done. And then the class that I clearly haven't like, haven't been to a class yet. I won't even know about that because they haven't even uploaded like the syllabus versus my two classes have already uploaded the syllabus. So I already know like what's expected, what I'm going to be doing, the assignments that need to be turned in within the next week. So I feel like I could get a head start on those, but we'll kind of see what I feel when I get home. Okay, so I'm officially home and starting to get comfy. It's 6.32 right now. And I did decide to write all of my assignments on my notebook. And I think I'm gonna start some of them. So from the class today, I have to create, uh, not create, but I have to complete a theory scale. So I'm gonna do that. Literally as I'm doing my assignment, which I just completed, I got an email saying that I have a neurology appointment tomorrow. That like my appointment was just scheduled at seven at night. What? Like an appointment was made today for tomorrow. Maybe my husband called and made it for me. 
Why did he make it for 8.20 in the morning? Why? I don't have class tomorrow. <laughs> On the bright side, I'll have an early rise. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, okay. That's so just like so weird because I didn't make myself an appointment. It's 33 minutes away and he made it for 8.20 in the morning. Yay me. Okay, cool. So I just finished that assignment. I don't think I'm ready for school. Can I drop out? I'm just kidding. I'm not. I'm just not 100% ready. Or I guess I don't feel ready. But I don't know if you'll ever feel ready. Do you know what I mean? Like, I don't feel like I'd ever feel ready or ever feel like prepared enough or anything like that. And I don't know what I could like do to make me feel more prepared, but I don't think anything could make me feel more prepared than just starting. Let me know if y'all think the same, but I'm just like, the more you wait, when will you ever actually be ready to do it, you know? So I think I've waited long enough. Okay, so I am wrapping up all of the things that I am currently doing and I'm gonna go get dinner. So it's currently eight o'clock. So it's been a long day. I woke up at like nine today, which is actually pretty late, which was nice to sleep in. I'm definitely gonna go get dinner, some Chipotle, shower, relax, especially if I have a neurology appointment now at 8.30 in the morning. And also I texted my husband and he was like, I did not schedule you an appointment. That's weird. But I just got like a new referral because every year I have to get like a new referral um, because they expire and stuff. I just got my doctor to put in a referral. So maybe like they automatically made an appointment for me with the referral that they had gotten. The crappy thing about it is their office doesn't open until eight, like their neurology clinic and it's 33 minutes away. So I would have to wake up and actually like start driving there before I or my husband could call them and be like, hey, we just want to clarify that, you know, Deanna does have an appointment. Because if I do, I'll definitely go. I need to go. It's been months since I've been able to see the neurologist and I'm supposed to go every other week. So I definitely need to go in and get seen for my migraines again. I've been getting seen for like six years, done everything. I've done Botox, like uh, migraine Botox. I've done the shot in the leg, the shot in the arm, all the medications that you can try. So it's kind of like, I'm going back to see if there's anything else that I could try or ways to like lessen the migraines that I have, especially going back to school. I feel like it's going to heighten them. So I definitely want to go get seen, but now I'm like, now I have an 8.30 a.m. appointment. I would have never made an appointment for that early for myself, unless that was the only appointment they had. Um, So yeah, I'm going to go get dinner and then figure out this whole <laughs> neurology appointment thing and then kind of just like wind down for the night, watch Suits. Sounds like a plan to me. That being said, don't forget to leave a like and a comment comment and subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys in next week's video. Let me know if there are any like college related videos that y'all want me to do. I kind of just wanted to do like a day in my life on my first day of school mostly because I've been so nervous for it so I'm like I'm just gonna vlog my first day of my grad program. So yeah let me know if you guys want me to do like a week in my life more of like a mapped out day in my life. I could also do that like literal hour by hour showing you guys my schedule. I haven't done a morning routine in a while. I could also do that if you guys would like. So yeah, definitely let me know and I will see you guys in next week's vlog.